Welcome back. A well-known Israeli choreographer is giving the stage to women between the ages of 62 and 82. Ori Lenkinski is here to talk about Go, a new Tel Aviv performance. Hello, hello. hello. I love this. I love watching this. I mean, what a, you know, what a great, great idea. We haven't had anything like this True. so far. So tell me about this choreographer, in particular, Galit Lis. She's very well-known here in Israel. Uh, yeah, she's well known. She's independent, um, and she started like ten years ago. She began working with um, older dancers. Uh, she interviewed women over seventy that had never danced professionally before, um, and she took a cast and they made a performance. And then she found her calling, which is working with the older female body. Wow, that really is amazing. Because yeah, I was I was seeing like she runs workshop. Like it's more mm -hmm. than just actually doing a professional presentation. Like, well, what she, she, she said, I met with her earlier in the week, and she told me that after the first performance, they would do these questions and answer sessions afterwards, and and all of these older women from the audience would say, I want to dance. Too. Too. I want to dance Aww. also. So she started teaching workshops, and now it's it's led to this new production, which is a really huge cast, 18 dancers, 62 to 82 years old. Wow. Um, unprecedented. Really amazing. And none of these were, like, I mean, were many of them just dancers when they were younger, but just not professional? Or what like she says is that almost novices. everyone that is working with her, they're all women that had danced in some form when they were young girls, mm -hmm. and their families forced them to stop at some point because they had to do more practical things or invest in their studies or because dancing, being a professional dancer, had strange connotations at that time. And so all of these women are sort of rediscovering, oh yeah, God, rediscovering like the dream. Child. All right, let's yep. take a look at a clip. It's not from Go. It's a different one, mm -hmm. right? Okay, but the same, same concept. Well, I mean, you really, you could just, this has just got to be so amazing for these women. I Absolutely. Mean, this is like... And amazing for the audience as well. Yeah. And specifically with Go, Galit brought in, she's married to a man who's been in the Air Force for his entire career. So she's bringing together these two worlds of the older female body and the military man and juxtaposing them. And she said it brings up for her a lot of things about Israeli society, about what bodies we respect, what bodies we oppress, wow, what bodies really we want to see. So she's really a socially conscious Absolutely. choreographer. But, and like, I, yeah, but she ahead. didn't set out I don't think she set out on this project to do to make social change but it's sort of happening kind of happened, internally right, and I think and that's really naturally. beautiful um, okay so also the, there's gonna be a performance here yes. at the at the Suzanne uh, Della no. I, I every week Suzanne Della and I'm always afraid <laughs> I'm gonna say the name wrong so uh, what is the so, performance yes, three performances uh, 20th 29th of December and I think the 15th of January at Suzanne Della Galita is producing this all independently she's been supported by the National Lottery Association but wow. other than that she's completely out on her own um, and it's a really beautiful project, really inspiring. Oh, amazing. Very cool. Well, thank yeah. you. Ari. Thanks for having All me. All right. Have a good weekend.